Oh wow, it just costs money. That's good. Well, there you go. That's nice. Also, I'm 450 and I look like fucking trash. I have that, but I don't really... Don't really care to put it on. I actually... I actually killed an invader with a sniper. I'm proud of me. In Gambit. Anyway, welcome to the session. Let's go ahead and take care of anything. Yeah, I think I'll just go with this one. Uh, the Mad Bomber. Avenge Cade's death by crossing the scorned baron known as the Mad Bomber off your list. Alright. Can I go in here with my sparrow? No. <laughs> well, I answered that, I guess. Oh. What's that? Uh-huh. Ugh. What fortune? A playmate up here. Playmate? Hello, hello, hello. Oh. To begin, a gift. A gift just at you. I'm not the playmate. Good friend, Canix. Best friend, Canix. Go, go, go. Open gift. I hope you're not the playmate. Okay. Is it gonna be better than this? I don't think it is. Okay. You can have that. Hey, have that. Never mind. Uh huh. You guys gonna run away forever or what? Wow, you fucking ran. Holy shit. Do I just kill him here? That'd be nice. Ah. We have to disable that splinter mine, or this whole place will blow. Oh, okay. What? How'd that miss? Oh, it killed him. Fucking fat fingered Q. Well. Oh, I have someone helping, I guess. Never mind. <laughs> so, this should be fun. At least it's quick, it's not slow. Oh, yeah, hey guys, welcome back. <laughs> this is more uh, Forsaken. I do have a couple things to talk about, but I'm gonna hold off on talking about them. I'll try to talk about them during a session at least. But there's kind of a lot going on right now. I don't know why I don't aim. Where am I? Huh? stupid knowing. But not you. <laughs> Red Legion ships above us. Must be the cabal the bomber mentioned. Let's follow them. But this is an event. Ugh. Oh, well, I got shot down. Oh, God. I'm doing some sweet fucking tricks. Holy shit. God, they were. I never tried it, but. I would play. What was it? Sparrow Racing? I forgot what it was called. I could probably take it over that, but I don't really care enough to. Or I could just respawn it. No. Bad. Still? Eh. I'll be there eventually. Such a big open area right here. Hi. Eh, no wonder you guys are losing. Yeah, I really like this scout rifle. No idea how it fares in multiplayer, I'll probably find out. Probably won't be good. Wanna go? Bitch. Uh-huh. 
Oh, war chief, fuck. Uh, they're kind of same distance. I'm fine. Again, you guys just don't know how to get rid of this. I'll blow those up for my sake. I really like the way this thing sounds. I don't know why. I want to at least get all the Gambit guns, but you know, I got three fucking scout rifles in a row. Apparently the revolver's good. I think it's trust, right? I want that. But no, I get three fucking scout rifles. I'm not going to shut up about it. Why the fuck did I get three of the same guns? I'm mad. Okay, let's do this again. Where's the captain? Capitan's way back there. Should check my armor real quick too, because I got something for doing the event I did a second ago. Cower! kind of gives off the same vibes as, um, uh, what the f- oh god, I forgot his name, I haven't played Warframe in forever, but, uh, I don't even know what the planet he's from is on, or what planet he's on, shit. I'll have to- I'll have to look up his name in a second. It's where you get fucking Equinox, Equinox parts, whatever that guy is. Kind of similar. Reminding me of him. This, uh, this... Oh wow, it's quick. Oh, a what? 34 seconds. Oh my god, is this... Is that sound from the, uh... Ah, uh, they've said it a couple times. The first... The fucking thing where everyone got out. The jail. That was the exact same sound as the mines from then. Oh, fuck. Hey, fuck off. I'm busy. Oh god, they've said the name several times. I mean, this... Yeah, the, the mind sounds are from that fucking thing. Oh god. Okay. I really can't remember the name of the thing. I keep- because every single time I want to say it, I think of Guild Wars 2 and my I, my brain wants to say Crucible of Eternity, which is a dungeon from Guild Wars 2. It's something else of Eternity, right? God, I wish my brain wasn't bad. Alright, I was wondering what this is for- oh god. The fuck? Are we in Assassin's Creed 4 now? Assassin's Creed 4, to me, is the most memorable one. So green, looks so nice. I think that was the one that started uh, Gabriel's liking of, like, water graphics or physics. Well, no, graphics, graphics. He fucking loves the way the water looks in Assassin's Creed 4. Now it does look nice. And still fucking holds up today. I mean... If you're thinking, like, why am I saying that, it still holds up. The game's from, like, 2014. It's kind of old now. I believe it's from 2014. It, it released with the PS4. I remember I had it at launch of the PS4 console. So that's why I'm saying it holds up. Yes, it's been, like, uh, five years, pretty much. So, it's a five-year-old game. It's old. It looks great. Oh, this one's gonna take a bit. I mean, the only thing I remember about the Ezio, Ezio trilogy is Ezio, and that one guy that dies. Sorry, spoilers. 
Uh, yeah, the one guy that dies that's close to Ezio. That's all I remember about the trilogy, really. Ezio was the best thing about that. Kill a kill? I mean, I could probably burn him with this. Yeah. Huh? Ow. Ooh, hello. Have granatas. Good. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? Come on. Oh, but yeah, the sight on this thing is really fucking comfortable, by the way. I like it a lot. There's a lot of sights in Destiny 2 I don't really like. So, this one's pretty clean. Pretty visible when you're aiming down sight. Oh, boy. That's a lot. That is a lot. I'm not done with this one yet! I'm not done with it yet. Okay, now I'm done. Good job. Ah, Jesus. Oh, I knew- I didn't like Assassin's Creed 3 too much, but the most memorable thing was when you play as a- to me, when you play as a kid, uh, and you go to, like, your fucking village burning and shit, and then Connor just- Connor's mother saves him, I believe. But she has, like, some fucking gigantic 2x4 just fucking land on her, like, legs and she can't move. And Connor's just like an 8-year-old kid. Can't do shit. Yeah, look at that. Hero. Burned. So yeah, that's... We have to leave. Hurry. I'm rigged to blow. I'm always ready to blow. Oh, this is cool. Another almost small like moment. I will always fucking love these, alright? Leave me alone. I don't care if they're all samey. Or it's uninspired. I fucking love it. I'm out. Nope. Not going that way. This area is nice too, though. It helps. Helps makes this nice little moment. Oh, hey, yeah, bye. I, well, I have to disable a mine while I'm here? Oh, yeah, I like the, uh, whatever this super is, by the way. I think I mentioned that already. I like the ability. I wish they had different grenades. I'm not a fan of the hunter grenades. The trip mine, of course, was great in Destiny 1 when it was, like, one-hit kill, pretty much. And now it, like, kind of does... Maybe 75% damage or so. It doesn't really kill in one uh, hit. Which, I mean, the grenade only has one hit in it. So. You're not going to get another hit with a grenade. So you can't really kill one person with a grenade unless they're already low on health. It was nice when it was one hit kill from full health. I miss that. No matter what the bomber said, you're not a murderer. Huh? Guardians are defenders of the light. Two barons down, six to go. I honestly wasn't paying attention to him. We just have to remember. We're doing this for Cade. Kai. Oh, hey, the event's going on. All right. Can't summon in this location. Eh. Summon, you bitch. Thank you. Oh, what was that? Not the floor, the, uh... Whatever the other thing was. Okay. Can this go away now? Yeah, the, you saw the lasers on the wall, right? Like crazy? I thought I was gonna die immediately stepping in here. <sighs> what was I saying? Fuck. God damn it, I really lost my train of thought. Like... With the lasers. <laughs> Fuck. I like how they're still talking while they're just like that.
I, I honestly can't fucking remember what I was just talking about. Fuck, I hate myself, dude. Well, I mean, I... The whole thing that I like Molek levels... It wasn't that. I was talking about Assassin's Creed 3, but I don't know if I was going to mention anything else. That more or less the only thing memorable to me about Assassin's Creed 3 was, of course, the part where... Well, spoilers, I already talked about it anyway, but... Yeah, where his mother dies... And Connor can't do shit, because he's a little baby. Like, literally, he's like eight years old or whatever. And he can't help his mom out of... A burning... Like, building. Because she's trapped underneath... A shitload of two-by-fours on fire. Nice. Guy died. And then no one's helping him, alright. That's cool. Okay, what next? Oh yeah, I need to look at my inventory. Oh, fuck, inventory. That's better. Looks terrible, but it's better. Better. And better. Actually getting better drops. I'm not ready to get rid of that. No. Well, I like my loadout. I really do. I want to keep it for as long as I can. Uh, I wanted to do them like... Oh god, there's another event. Like, I guess kind of in order of power level. It's right there. But yeah, the reason I don't like Assassin's Creed 3 as much, of course, I mean, to me, Connor was a little bit boring compared to Ezio. We just had, like, three games of Ezio. I- people- Glimmer is encrypted with a signature. A Raskis, the trickster. She's a coward who hides behind traps and flunks- COWARD! Bet we can find an informant somewhere around here. Okay. Hey, wait, I need to do that. Not you. Where? Oh, fuck. Oh, he's, this person's right here. Fuck. Oh! If a shipment of these rigged engrams ever made it to the last city, we can't let that happen. It was like a piss yellow engram. I mean, you'd be able to spot it. It'd, it'd be funky. Oof. But yeah, I, going from Ezio to Connor, I didn't really like Connor too much. A little bit boring. Oh, hey. What am I doing? Fabricators? Why the fuck are you guys here? I meleeed. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> and the main thing. Nice. It was, uh. See, it's piss yellow. Oh, God. Fuck. I. Yeah. I was trying to get back inside, but the throw animation was so long. Okay. I don't know what to do. What is a fabricator? Now I have to pick him up, looks like. I don't know where to throw him, though. Ah. Okay, that makes sense. Oh shit. 
good news? The Engram fabricators are destroyed, and I traced the source of the trickster's broadcast. Bad Further news. inside there? The trace was way too easy for someone called the trickster. Oh. I think it's in here. I don't know where I'm going. Yeah, it doesn't really tell me where. Oh, boy. I didn't trust that. So, there was a major sort of, I guess, gameplay mechanic change on- I guess, I don't know if that would- I don't know if switching buttons around would be considered a- Well, yeah, gameplay change, right? Where do I go? Over there. So, before- before Assassin's Creed 3, who the fuck? Who's shooting so much? Yeah, before Assassin's Creed 3, you had to hold a button to do like a... Some sort of stance that would then allow you to run, because otherwise you couldn't run. That was fine. I believe one button was for running and another one was for climbing, something like that. And what they did for Assassin's Creed 3 and onwards, at least up until I stopped playing around Assassin's Creed 4. No, I have uh, the ones after that, like one after that, that I played. Alright, you want to play that bitch? Yeah, immune. That's what I thought. That's not what I want. Yep. Got tricked by that too. Is that all the ammo? No, it's not the ones they drop. So, what they did was combine the free run button and the climb button to like B, I think, on the Xbox controller. And that made that made it fucking difficult to adjust playing the fucking game because when I wanted to run well I would run of course but then but then since it was combined to the uh, with the free run button I would climb buildings or climb something and just fucking run the fuck off and ultimately kill myself somehow uh, I, that is the thing. Yeah, you guys can have that. It just... It pretty much didn't feel right, and it was the cause of... a couple of deaths in my... playthrough when I played it back then. The last moment's pretty good. That, oh, that's actually something else I remember. Oh, hey. I forgot who you're running after, but Connor is just fucking blind with rage at the end of the game, chasing one motherfucker, and it's it's a good moment. I like it. But you have to chase him. Dead end. We want to go deeper. Yeah, no shit. Our way in. Oh, have knives. You have to chase him through some shit. Like a dock. And that's where I died like once or twice. Because the fucking free run button and the climb button are the same thing. And it caused me to lag behind every now and then when I would just climb some little shit and Connor would just sit there. I think after Assassin's Creed 3 I kind of adjusted to it so... I still don't like it. I think it's a shitty change, but I don't know why they did that. Oh, I have 10 seconds. Oh, okay. I was just looking at the color of it. I didn't realize there was seconds at the top. Let me do this. Eh. I don't know if that's faster. Probably not. There you go. Oh, you have enough time. More than enough. 
Yeah, I just don't like that change. I kind of wish it was back to normal. Two separate buttons for free running and climbing. Yes, we deserve it. Here is some ammo for you. <laughs> oh shit, I'm out. Can I just kill you? No, you're immune. You're immune. Okay, no, good. God, I really like the super... Oh, that's what I was talking about. I was in the middle of talking about the trip mine. Guess that's it. Well, for that. Yeah, wow, no... Nothing from the ghost. Weird. Weird. Okay, on to the next. 420. It's right there. I was going to talk about the swarm grenade after the trip mine. The swarm grenades, all right. And then the incendiary grenade just, it kind of just bounces around and sits there. It's not like the other one. I forgot what it's called. But the Titan and the, uh, the Warlock have it. It sticks to people. This servitor's been oh, I didn't read it. No. Mauled. I see a name carved into it. Rexus Vaughn. The Hangman. I've got a lead on him. That's your lead. A chest. Thank you. I just don't really like the, uh, summon the thing. Hunter grenades. I'll have no cape. Have the hood. No cape. I guess I wasn't really feeling golden gun either. Oh no. Where? Okay, why did it tell me it was up there for a second? At least I think it did. That was almost bad. That's one of Spider's servitors. It might help us out if we free. Will it now? Oh, it's yeah, it's spiders. Never mind. Ah, oh, fuck. I thought I'd... Yeah, I was gonna shoot my grenade. Don't have it. Come on. Just stop with that. Thank you. Yeah, I'll get you guys in a second. Why are you guys just sitting here? You're not moving at all. Weird. You're just staring at something. Yeah, no, we're not gonna have any of whatever you want to give us. Servitors are holy to the fallen. They create the ether that the fallen need to survive and grow. It's shocking that the scorn, who were once fallen, would even attack servitors. Don't think they need it. Oh god, a little fast. So what is this? What is this? The heart of an ascendant primeval. I'll take that, thank you very much. We'll use it later. Uh, you While defeat- uh, here, Get this. A while back, this punk stole something important to me. Thing is, he's like us. Ever living till you get his ghost. But seeing as I ain't laid eyes on him in something like forever, guessing his ghost probably got... got. So do me a favor, and, uh, go see if that punk has what's mine, huh? I'd do it myself, but as you can see, I'm a busy man. I guess. Besides, you're the closest thing to reliable I've met in a century. You've defeated a particularly powerful primeval in Gambit and taken its heart. A drifter might find it valuable. Take it to him. So, by the way, earlier today I just finished my Warlock's armor, which by the way I can't fucking wear. It's all level, light level 500, and my, I need to be level 43, I'm fucking 41. The solstice armor, I don't think I said that. 
And I went on my Titan and also just did Gambit matches across them all since they had them as dailies. I just did my Hunter one earlier and we fought the meatball thing, the weird servitor. I vaguely remember something in Dado's video, Dado, whatever, it, however you pronounce his name. I can't recall what that was necessary for, but I remember the meatball being important to get at some point, and I'm not sure if this is that. Because after we killed it, I got whatever this is. And he- yeah, this says a particularly powerful primeval. Not sure if that's that, but okay. Well, all right then. You got somewhere to be? Yeah. How about Gambit? Uh, only maybe for the dailies. Nothing else. Search for clues about the thief in the, in the Dreaming City. Oh, taking bosses or mini bosses. Ugh. Yeah, actually, out of my warlock and my titan for dailies. Oh, and my hunter for the uh, daily gambit. My hunter had the easiest time. Which, by the way, I like the gun I have on right now. But can you please tell me why the fuck I got the same scout rifle on every character? From the daily reward, I got the same fucking scout rifle. And the first one was this one. And I like this one a lot, actually. Explosive payload. I don't really care too much about that. And these, I don't really pay attention to, but there they are, if you want to look at them. I like this one a lot, I just did whatever this was, and I don't think I really made a difference. This was the second one. I was going to try it out, but, uh, crouched. Accurized round seems to be, like, the only good thing on it. So I might delete this one. This one seems the most useless. This one, I might have this one eat. Oh, that was my mouse, if you heard it. Fell down. Anyway. Uh, apparently Ambitious Assassin isn't bad, at least I've seen a couple people talk about it. I don't know, I don't think I really care too much about it. And yeah, these three are the same things, I don't... So I don't care for these two because this one has explosive payload, so I'm just probably gonna keep this one. And have it eat this one. We'll see. Or I'll just do it right now, I don't care about the other two to be honest.